All right, after Tuesday's sports wagering action, we improved to 5-0 and in our last five board member tier package bets on BrockPage.com. And the link for today's board member tier package bet is in the description section below. $1,000 bettors are up over $4,500 during that span. Now, the board member tier is an all-inclusive package that I offer on that website. And not only do you get access to my board member tier package bet itself, you also get access to every single bet that I give out on that webpage all the way through the end of February. Now, if you're not signed up for that package or if you have no idea what I'm talking about, I'm going to go ahead and explain a little bit more about that in just a moment. But before we go ahead and move on, just want to take a quick time out and welcome you to the video. My name is Brock Page and I do sports picks for free right here on YouTube. I also sell my personal bets on BrockPage.com and I have packages on that website starting at just $1.99. Now, the purpose of these YouTube videos is to provide you with free informational sports betting content. And it's also designed to generate interest in signing up for a membership on my website. Now, you may be wondering what the difference is between what I do here on YouTube and what I do on my webpage. And well, what I do here on YouTube is I'll handicap the entire slate of games in any given sport side in total. And what I do on my website is, well actually share with you which one of these free YouTube picks on my channel that I'm actually betting on personally. And with that, guys, let's go ahead and get into our part two video here today. Uh, we're going to take a look at the Suns taking on the Thunder, 8 o'clock Eastern tip-off on Thursday, February 24th, 2022. Phoenix is minus 10 and a half, totals 214. Now, the Suns are on a seven-game winning streak and they actually lost only two games since December 31st of last year. Phoenix is currently 38, um, 38 games above 500 right now. They're actually leading the entire NBA in guarding the three ball. Now, Phoenix allows just 105 points a game on the road. When it comes to the scoring in this one, Devin Booker is averaging 25.5 points per contest, along with five rebounds and four and a half assists. Meanwhile, DeAndre Ayton, he's scoring 16 and a half points a game himself, along with double-digit boards. And speaking of rebounds, Phoenix is currently in the top five in the NBA in offensive boards per game. They're taking on a Thunder team who wins just 32% of their home games, and they actually score fewer points per contest than any other team in the association. Now, OKC, they currently rank dead last in shooting from the field, they're also making only 31% of their three-pointers. Uh, simply put, these guys are the worst shooting team in the NBA. Now, injury-wise, leading scorer Shea Gilgis-Alexander, he's still out indefinitely. Muscala and Robinson Earl, they're still out as well. And, of course, in addition to all that, Williams, Dort, and Jerome, they're all questionable to play for OKC as well. Meanwhile, for Phoenix on the other side of things, Chris Paul is out and definitely for them. Payne and Shamit, uh, they're questionable to go as well. When it comes to the total on this one, Phoenix is currently 16 and 11 to the under on the road this year. Meanwhile, OKC saw unders recently with Chicago, Philadelphia, and Golden State. I'm going to lean toward Phoenix minus 10 and a half and the under 214.